President Obama is highlighting extraordinary changes in the Middle East and North Africa. He gave a major speech yesterday at the State Department, and the president said the U.S. and the world have an important stake in that volatile region. Our own future is bound to this region by the forces of economics and security, by history and by faith. The White House says the recent death of Osama bin Laden has opened new opportunities for Western overtures in the Arab world. He says bin Laden was no martyr and that the al-Qaeda terrorist leader killed by a U.S. military strike earlier this month obviously has uh, sort of been a game changer in the fight against terrorism. Teams of NASA experts carefully examining new images. Some of the tiles on the belly of the space shuttle uh, were damaged. And that scares people because you'll remember that space shuttle that lost tiles and when it re-entered, it uh, burned up. Seven areas of damage have been found on the shuttle's thermal tiles. Those tiles have been a problem since the day they invented the shuttle. And NASA's Leroy Kane says there are three more that need study. This is not cause for alarm. It's not cause for, for any concern. That's easy for him to say sitting down on Earth, isn't it, Gary Austin? Yeah, well, you know, any time we talk about tiles in the space shuttle, yeah. you know, we remember... You know, no the, cause the, for alarm. Yeah, the, the tragic mishap. But, Where you know, NASA also... Tonight? Yeah, you know, I think he wants to, to make it clear that NASA has a handle on this. Um, and, uh, you know, he doesn't want to get true. everybody all riled up anyway. You know, the U of M Board of Regents okaying a plan. This is sort of controversial with money being what it is nowadays making some big changes to the very historic Chrysler Arena. Mm -hmm. And here's the plan. Keep the original building intact so historians and preservationists, they're happy. Keep everything as is. Um, keep the old building there. But build an even bigger one around it. It's all oh. expected to be wrapped up in 2014. Mm -hmm. And Dr. Jack Kevorkian, remember him? He's now 82, and he's back in the hospital. He's got pneumonia. He had been in earlier dealing with kidney problems. Mm -hmm. And um, auto sales so far this month seem to be slowing down a bit. However, the experts are saying with the weather warming up, we're going to get more in that buying mood. And even with these high gasoline prices, the AAA says quite a few still plan on going somewhere during the upcoming Memorial Day holiday Speaking weekend. Speaking of the U of M, it looks like John Cherry, the former lieutenant governor, is hmm. probably going to run for a spot on the Board of Regents in 2012 if uh, Olivia Maynard retires hmm. at the end. Right. So he'll be back in the act 30 hmm. minutes after the hour.